Welcome to the Rustic Garden. Zucchini and squash are two plants, many kinds of varieties that will grow really, really well in your garden. I just wanted to talk about two things. One, you can see most of these leaves are completely green. There's no white markings on there. And sometimes people get a little worried when they see this. This is not a disease. There's nothing bad on this plant. It's just the variety. And those white markings, if they show up on your leaves, they are not a problem. That's just part of how your plant grows, part of the variety. And that's often cute, uh, confused with powdery mildew. Powdery mildew is a powder. It will look like somebody put fine powder across your leaves and that is a problem and that does need to be treated. But again, most of the time the leaves are really, really green, but you may have a variety or you may have some leaves that show this pattern on your zucchini and those white markings are really nothing to worry about. The second thing that I wanted to talk about was mulching. This is cedar mulch down there. And when I lean this plant back, you can see that it's very clean underneath the leaves. And this is a really easy way to look for squash bug, squash bug eggs, you know, other kinds of eggs, or any kind of problem in your garden. The mulch keeps the splash of the mud from getting up on your leaves and it can really make a difference. The plants are much more healthy when they don't have dirt all underneath the leaves and it's much easier to find the squash bug eggs. This is what happens if you don't mulch and this is going to get mulched tomorrow but I wanted to just show you an example. You can see right here that should say scallop but the dirt from the rain just splashed up on there and then underneath here all along the stem it's just packed with dirt and that's a great way to spread disease onto your plants and this holds true for tomatoes, pepper plants, anything, any spores or anything that's sitting in your soil, the rain hits it or you water it splashes up and it looks like that. That's one reason to really mulch and that's to create a disease barrier so that spores don't splash up on your plant. Hope you enjoyed my video. Please check out my blog at www.therusticgarden.blogspot.com and also check out my YouTube videos. Thanks.